the you know European Union and the 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 organization out there that in a great way they're trying to protect the privacy of their citizens. It is a great thing. I think though in the nuance of some of that some of the essence maybe got lost as in probably most bills out there in, in law. But uh, overall, uh, it is very detailed. I mean, holy cow! I think the 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 statute is you know, hundreds of pages or something. So. You know, most people are going to read that. And even if you do read that, you're not going to interpret it maybe all the same way. There still is a lot of gray in that in the GDPR process. Uh, but for the most part, the, the the high level checklist ideas are pretty consistent and they're not that hard to implement as a business to then uh, hold that compliance and talk to those European uh, customers, even sometimes in a in a in a in a good way i guess but uh even sometimes some american companies might require it even though it doesn't quite apply because it's not in europe but uh, it is a really good privacy framework to follow so a great checklist you know off the top of my head we can go talk through them all but to keep it short and sweet is uh the two that i uh i'll shout i guess i'll shout out for us andrada uh it's very easy, you know, just just go to uh, drada.com, go to the footer. I think on the right side, there's a GDPR link and we list how we follow uh, uh, the GDPR. There's just essentially like eight or nine categories and we just kind of say, yeah, we're following them and this is how. Uh, and so, you know, there's a lot of internal into that, but from an external spot, you'll see those eight or so uh, checklist, you know, bullet points of what you need to do. I would say probably one of the best guides online, though, is uh, HubSpot. They did a fantastic job of giving you what is GDPR and then a lot of FAQs around it. Why do I need to follow it? And this is like very high level, you know, the major things you need to do. So what I've always done in my past, even when I need a refresher, is I just Google HubSpot space GDPR. It's like the first link and you can kind of go through that page. That's honestly where I would look and tell everyone to go.